Hello friends, thank you very much for joining in. Hi, this is Ganesh Nayak. I help finance professionals and students to clear their FRM and CFA exam in first attempt. Now, this video is especially for students who have just given their November 2021 level one exam and they're confused how their performance was in the exam or they were worried about their performance, okay? So primarily the exam has been heavy theory, okay? And people who have been preparing a lot of calculation, they were kind of not comfortable solving the theory in the exam, okay? And they felt that the exam was heavy conceptually driven and they were checking every nook and corner of the book. And all of this is true, but it is true for all the students. So it's not only difficult for you, it is not only theoretical for you, it's for everyone else. This exam is a competitive exam. It's a relative based exam. So even if you're not doing good, okay, you have to look at it from the perspective that at the entire global level, how students would be performing. So if there are students who are performing worse than you, then you would be able to clear the exam. So from that perspective, think not only from the absolute term, but also from the relative term in, in, in your exam result. That is the first part. The second part, I would like to share a small experience of mine with, with, with a group of my students, okay? There were three, four students who gave the exam in the month of July and when they gave the exam, okay, primarily they were college students and they uh, prepared through Swager. They went for the exam and when they came back from the exam, their first reaction or they when, when we talked, their first reaction was whatever they read from the Swager was not there in the exam. Okay, and they were kind of disheartened. They were like, hey, we were not uh, prepared for the exam or X, Y, Z, okay? But let me tell you that they were they were panicking primarily because they expected a particular set of questions to come from the from the Swager or the way it is written in Swager to come in the exam. But the similar question came, but the concepts were tested or it was tested in a slightly different manner, which they were not expecting. But when the result came out, okay, around three out of four people from that group, they cleared the exam. So it is not like that, that if your exam, if you feel right now that your exam has not gone well because there was the heavy theory, you're not able to judge your performance because if it would have been a quantitative exam, you would have known that, okay, I've, I've solved uh, out of 100, out of 100, around 60, 70 questions, right? In this case, it is, you're not able to judge your performance. That is normal, okay? But it does not mean that you're gonna fail the exam. Okay, because this, this pattern has come to all, almost all of them. Okay, one more important point that that is also there uh, when you look at the result. Okay, uh, result a lot of students who have been waiting for their exam for the last two years. Okay, okay? especially in India where the exams explicitly did not happen. Okay, so people who, who got uh, cancelled, uh, postponed their exam from May 2021 also. Now, a lot of those students who I know were not well prepared for the exam, even though they had a lot of time. Okay, so they were not well prepared up to the mark. So that is also going to play a, a role in your result. So I feel that a decent score should be around 55 to 60 to clear the level one exam in November 2021. Okay, I, I know that you guys might not be able to judge your performance, but on an average, if you're being able to solve with an accuracy, if you are able to solve the entire question bank, or of 100 questions with an accuracy of around 60 to 65 percent also you should be able to clear the exam okay so do not worry let us wait for the result and i'm sure a lot of you guys would clear the exam now when the result comes in in the, Jan in the month of january also if you guys are thinking of preparing for the level two exams okay and don't want to waste your next one one and a half month you can reach out to me on my whatsapp number the number is available on the description i can help you and guide you to prepare and not waste your next one and a half month. Okay. Thank you very much guys.